um, um, has grown here at the bottom of this field. Um, we're, we're closest to the uh, to the wall actually of the um, of the old chemical works now. In fact, the wall is probably about uh, 20 yards away, I should say, at the most. But um, this is the problem that uh, Mr. Elliot's getting: um, something like this, stunted growth, strange colour. Um, and die off and in fact that just literally took, it came up and died off and you can see it's uh, it's not looking good at all um, and that's repeated actually right across the bottom part of this field so uh, let's, let's have a look and see if we can find some uh, some more examples of, uh, of this okay here we go this is a uh, this is the uh, this is quite commonplace on the on the site actually here where uh, we got an, an awesome amount of die off if you look at uh, that, that is in fact a nettle, believe it or not. Um, th this particular site where we are at the moment hasn't been sprayed, and as you can see, um, it's been all cordoned off um, by the farmer. Um, but um, this is almost commonplace to what you find here at the moment, and as you can see, that is not very well at all. Um, it may well be that. Uh, that's some kind of groundwater contamination. We, well, we certainly think so. The the bold leaf effect, where the the outsides of the leaf turn up, um, that's quite common amongst uh, a lot of the nettles. Actually, uh, quite close to the to the sides of the factory, as you will see um, as we go along. Even these nettles here, um, next door to it, um, these nettles are showing signs of uh, the leaves curling up, and um, of course they're not very well at all. That there, you can see there, it's a, it's a prime example just there of a, a leaf that's uh, that's um, just curled up, and uh, we don't not quite sure why that might be, um, but uh, it seems very very strange indeed that the other types of nettle here um, are, are still growing okay, but clumps seem to uh, do seem to occur. There's uh, a little bit more there of. Um, what we call burn off actually and it's if you look at the leaves they uh, they tend to show actually I think it's fair to say uh, that there's something seriously wrong with that it's it's not a case of um, a contact weed killer being uh, being placed on this either because the the leaves are not burned off as you would expect to find with some uh, some some weed killers it's it's definitely something in the water that they're uh, that they're actually uh, uh, they're pulling up from the from the water table I think there's another Another prime example there of a plant that's just quite simply died for, for no apparent reason. I'm, we're not 100% certain why it's died, but um, it's just uh, given up really. It's uh, very, very strange indeed. That number, as I say, there's a number of plants here that are exactly the same as that, and uh, you find these all along the side of the works where um, it appears that plants are growing in a strange fashion or just, being, or just dying off. Right, well here we are again. Um, we're at the side of the Riddy, and uh, as you can can see there, that's quite a nice little flow here actually. Uh, this is the wall that was put up. Of, I don't know quite why the wall's there, but um, if you look very closely here, you'll see some damp patches above the water line, uh, and it appears that something's leaking out of the uh, or leaching out of the wall there into the uh, into the water but uh, we're not quite sure what that might be uh, could be just about anything of course um, and uh, that's uh, that's quite true of uh, most other places along here as well
go. More prime example there of uh, something being, I think, seriously wrong. It doesn't look good at all. But uh, and then, of course, we go on. We look at other nettle here. And we don't see the same problem as we go along. But um, these are quite interesting as well. Um, stunted growth, funny colour. There we go. Look at these. It's not not good at all. Um, in fact, that's feeling quite quite awful with the looks of things. Um, this tells a tale. Look at that. Now that leaf there is cupped. That is commonplace with the nettle. Um, I would say that is some kind of herbicide damage, to be frank. Um, and the leaf accord should look like this, which has now died off. But uh, yeah, very interesting. Very interesting indeed. This particular area here is highly contaminated with uh, something or the other, I would say. Almost definitely. <laughs>